Hi, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. We are solving examples as part of mathematical induction. Till now, we have seen examples which involve equality between the LHS and RHS or the statements which involves equality of left hand side and right hand side. So, for the first time, we will look at one example where we are talking about inequality. So, we have to prove this statement is true where 1 plus 2 plus 3 up to n terms is less than 1 by 8 into 2n plus 1 into whole square. So, we will start with the basic steps what we do always. We will start, start with the step 1. The step 1 is to prove that it's the statement is true for n equal to 1. For a specific value, generally we take n equal to 1 unless it is given that this is the value the range of n is given ok so if n equal to 1 LHS is equal to 1 RHS is equal to 1 by 8 into RHS equal to 1 by 8 into 2 into n that is 2 into 1 is 2 plus 1 whole square that's nothing but 1 by 8 into 2 into 1 is 2 2 plus 1 is 3 3 square that's nothing but equal to 9 by 8 which is nothing but equal to 1.125 so you know obviously that 1 is less than 1.125 ok now second step second step is we have to assume that the statement holds true for n equal to k so second step assuming n equal to k true what will be the statement looks like the statement looks like 1 plus 2 plus 3 up to k terms is less than 1 by 8 into 2k plus 1 whole square we haven't done anything other than substituting n with the value of k now we have assumed that this is true then what we have to do we have to prove we have to prove that the statement is true for n equal to k plus 1. We have to prove that the statement is true for n equal to k plus 1. How it looks like? What we have to prove? Let us look at what we have to prove. We have to prove that 1 plus 2 plus 3 up to k plus 1 terms that is nothing but k, k term plus k plus 1 is less than 1 by 8 into instead of k I should put k plus 1 so it will be 2 into k plus 1 plus 1 whole square nothing but 1 by 8 into 2k plus 3 whole square I have to prove this I have to prove this now let's go back and we have assumed that 1 plus 2 plus 3 up to k terms is less than 1 by 8 into 2 k plus 1 whole square now if I write k plus 1 terms what it will look like as I said earlier 1 plus 2 plus 3 go up to k th term then add k plus 1th term we are starting from LHS now we want to prove that it is less than RHS so we are starting from here now you can observe that the first k terms we already assumed that it is less than 1 by 8 into 2k plus 1 whole square so I can straightforward say this is less than 1 by 8 into 2k plus 1 whole square plus k plus 1 let me repeat that again the first step we have proven for n equal to 1 second we have assumed that the statement is true for n equal to k so how it looks like is 1 2 3 up to k terms is less than 1 by 8 into 2 k plus 1 whole square what I have to prove is up to k plus 1 terms some of them should be less than or equal to 1 by 8 into 2 k plus 3 whole square this is what I have to prove now if I start from the LHS how the k, k plus 1 terms look like I see that it is nothing but sum of k terms plus the k plus 1 term 
but we already assumed that the all the k terms the sum of k terms is less than 1 by 8 into 2k plus 1 whole square so i can write lhs equal to and i can say that's nothing but equal to 1 by 8 into 2k plus 1 whole square plus k plus 1 now if i simplify this this is nothing but 2k plus 1 whole square plus 8 into k plus 1 by 8 if i simplify that again that's nothing but 4k square a square plus b square that is 1 2ab 2 into 2k into 1 that is 4k plus 8 into k plus 1 that's nothing but 8k plus 8 divided by 8 that's obviously nothing but equal to 4k square plus 4k plus 8k is 12k plus 1 plus 8 is 9 divided by 8 which is nothing but equal to 2k plus 3 whole square by 8 and this is what we have to prove we have to prove that LHS is less than or equal to 1 by 8 into 2k plus 3 whole square so that's what we have proven what we have done this particular step is always crucial in mathematical induction whenever you want to prove you are taking that whatever the sum of k terms you have already assumed that it is true the statement is true so i can directly pick rhs of that and i can keep it here and put the condition it should be less than so i will put less than substitute 1 to k with 1 by 8 into 2 k plus 1 whole square then i'll add up the k plus 1 term and that's how we have proven that the statement holds good for any value of counting numbers or the natural numbers We'll solve some more examples on inequality in coming videos. Thanks for visiting. Bye for now. See you.